In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create this toggle switch button in Unity without coding. So once you're in Unity, create an empty object inside a canvas. Make sure it's inside a canvas because we're gonna add UI elements to this object. So here I'm adding two UI buttons, one for the on and another one for the off button and an image that will be the handle. So here I'm just adjusting everything, making sure everything is in the right place and with the right size. I'm adding the respective images to each of the elements. And I'm gonna delete the text from the buttons because the images that I'm using already have their own text in it. So this is the part that does the toggling for us. So basically I'm gonna create three on-click events for each button. So for example, if I click the on button, the on will be deactivated and the off button will be activated and vice versa. So if I click on play, as you can see, the toggle is already working. So when I click on, it goes off. And when I click off, it goes on. So now to create the handle animation so that it moves from one side to another, I'm going to create three animations. The first one is toggle on, which will make the handle go from left to right. And how it works is you press the red button. And after that, every change you make to the handle will be recorded. So to make the toggle of animation is exactly the same thing, but backwards. So the handle will go from right to left. And finally, I'm gonna create an idle animation, which is only to prevent Unity from playing the animation from start. So in the animator, you need to make sure that the default state is the idle animation. So now you need to select the two buttons again, the on and the off. And on the on click event on the third function we added, where we added the handle image, select animator and then play with string and type in the exact name of the animation you want to play. If you got it wrong the first time, just like me, you're fine. Just try it again and make sure that the off button has the toggle on animation and the on button has the toggle off animation. Another thing is that right now when you click directly on the handle, it doesn't work because it is an image and it has a raycast target. So disable that and now you can click anywhere on the toggle and it will be triggered. So I'm going to create a new script that will handle a bool, which will be called value. I'm going to create a public bool variable. And on the start method, I'm going to make sure the variable starts being true. And then I'm going to create a public method that will be called toggle value that will actually toggle the value every time the function is called. So back in Unity, I'm going to go back to the inspector and we need to attach the toggle to the parent object or to any object in the scene and select the two buttons again, the on and off. And on the on click event, I'm going to add another function, which we'll call the function we just created. And that's it. So now if we go ahead and click play, we can go to the console and see the value of the toggle. Every time we click on it, it shows the new value. And uh, yeah, if you have any other requests for any other tutorials, let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching and I see you guys in the next video.